Hi, Ravi. Hi, Prickly. You can hear the music on your phone. Oh, maybe that's because it's too loud. Is it too loud? I don't know. Sorry, I have to go get coffee. <sighs> Did I miss anyone? Nope. I'll turn it. Awesome. Oh, okay. Thanks, Prickly. <sighs> okay. But, oh yeah, because my mic's different today too. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. So way. You did not become badger soup. I am so glad to hear that. Badger soup smell sounds like it would smell terrible. Yes. And also, you know, just like, you know, I'd much rather my friend have it have their full sort of meat suit corporeal thing going on. No worries, Ravi. Okay. Are we done with ads already? Did they go through that fast today? What the heck? Okay. Oh wait, I'm like sitting here like a a wally trying to fan myself with a washcloth. I actually have a fan somewhere on my desk. <laughs> Hi Beard! I don't know if you guys can see. Hang on. <laughs> we have we have a friend. I put a, a new filter on the mic and it needed googly eyes. Naturally. A fuzzy monster. Yeah. Uh, apparently Punky has named it Monsieur Le Pouf, I believe. Monsieur Le Pouf. Yeah, so I've always just used a standard pop filter, um, but these fuzzy ones are supposed to help with... Here we go. Oh, the fuzzy ones are supposed to help with wind. Um, so I thought it might help with my AC sounds. Yes. Like a Wally, Ravi. Like a Wally. It's really heck and muggy today, and I'm not doing well with it. So the problem is I'm going to keep on getting distracted because I have googly eyes now on my mic. And above my camera, like right up there, obviously you can't see, but right up there is a little face, which is what I use to like remind myself um, to like look at the camera. I don't even know if my pop filter would work uh, with that. This is my pop filter is really neat actually. It's curved so it like clamps onto the mic rather than having one of those big circles on an arm that always drops and gets in the way. So anyway, we're going to test that out. So let me know if I like, if I like bottom out or if I start peeking in a weird way. Um, it's really fucking hot today. I don't know why I'm feeling. Oh, never mind. Heat index 105. That'll do it. Um, I don't know if it'll help with blocking out neighbors. <laughs> I don't think anything's going to help with my neighbors um, setting up fireworks. So we'll see how that goes. So yeah, hi, welcome back to the start of a new week. It's nasty again. Yeah, I remember you saying it got better. Oh, 
It's so rude. How dare. I'm hoping it'll rain tomorrow and just make it absolutely miserable for all the assholes who want to go outside instead of, like, fireworks. Actually, no, not the fireworks. People think your fireworks aren't the problem. It's the people who set off, uh, the guns to celebrate. Because America... Sorry, I'm, like, super sweaty. My hair's wriggling because I'm sweaty. Um, so yeah. Awesome, thank you, Prickly. Prickly is like audio tech friend. Um, the fan is helping, honestly. The fan is doing a good job. Uh, what did you guys get up to at the beginning of the week? I think like Monday and what did I do? Monday I went shopping. It was very exciting. I bought some leggings. And that was it, really. Um, and then yesterday, I can't remember what I did yesterday. I know I watched some Star Trek Discovery the Flint at some point. I don't know what I did earlier on in the day. I have no idea. Oh, I did a bunch of lot of yard stuff. I did a bunch of weed eating. I replaced the carburetor and the gas tank and the blade on the lawnmower. Wait, what, Revy? A flamethrower? I'm not interested in flamethrowers, FYI. Fingers crossed. <sighs> um, <laughs> so that humble bundle that Flint has linked has a My Little Pony game in it. Um, and he's very, very kindly provided me with a key two keys actually you got one for me and one to share with a friend so if anyone wants to play my little pony uh, we have a, a hardcore my little pony i don't know i don't know the names of them Ravi. i am completely uh inexperienced when it comes to the world of My Little Pony. I don't even know what it is. He was looking at the games in the bundle and I was like, I might be tempted to play that out of, you know, like... I, a, a sense of spite. And then he sent me the key. So that's the thing. You've seen a lot. I mean, why not both? Why not both, Baron? Get masks and machine guns. Oh, uh, it's not my cup of tea. My little Mad Max pony, that would be amazing. They're all just like running around with Australian accents. Get away from my hate, motherfucker. Be great. Um, yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know anything about My Little Pony. I remember My Little Pony when I was a little girl, but it's changed since then. I do remember having one that had, uh, I had a Pegasus one that had like, wings that would like flutter when you pushed a button on its back and i i tried to sneak it to school a couple of times because i had to show off that i had a my little pony and the one day that i finally did get away with <clears throat> taking it to school it got stolen by the mean girl uh and i never had another my little pony after that so maybe I have some 
<laughs> some suppressed memories about my little pony. Who steals a My Little Pony? Seriously. The friendship of, of magic. I mean, this this latest iteration. Hi, Shay. Um, this latest iteration has been around a while now, right? Like, I think I remember my friend talking about it like 2000-ish. Like when I when I left New Zealand, maybe 2010? You had My Little Pony as a child too? Um, 2007, I think I remember my friend talking about, that was when I left New Zealand, I think I remember my friend here talking about specifically My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. Yeah, they were very different when I was a lot, a lot uh, a very different art style for the cartoons. So anyway, we, we may end up playing a My Little Pony game just for shits and giggles. Um, maybe I'll save it for when I'm up in Ohio and I'll install it on Dean's computer. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Um, <laughs> it's, it's not my usual thing, but hey, that's okay. So, uh, yeah, we, we're doing... We're going to do a vintage story today. I figured out what was wrong. Like, when I was trying to figure out what was going on on Sunday night, I know what I did wrong. It's an easy fix. Um. So, yeah. That's, that's the plan. Vintage story today. Uh, Friday, I'll probably be late. Uh, Friday stream, because we've got a... Uh, bonus mom has a doctor's appointment. Um, but I have no plans for the rest of this week. Maybe I'll see if Coda wants to play My Little Pony. <laughs> so yeah. Um. I also got like devoured by mosquitoes last night, which was so much fun. Monsieur Le Pouf is staring at me. And it's not blinking. Um. So I do, I'm not sure how we're going <laughs> to... Oh, it's all right. It was my own fault. I went into the swimming pool in the evening. Um. And I forgot to put insect repellent on. And they were like, hey, there's a human that looks delicious. Let's eat it. Um, that's so... I was very helpful. I was helping... I was slapping them when they landed on, on Flint. I, I may have accidentally clogged them in the air at one point. Um... Because he was one on on his ear. So I'll get my hair up. I'm overheating. Oh, that looks so fucking weird. Right, that loo. Just gonna have to look like I've got poo on my head. So yeah, okay. Vintage story. Enough of big face doll. You don't need that. Is it gonna stay out? I think it will. Just until I cool down. Um, but yes, I was late like, because I forgot what time it was, as I usually do. And then uh, Flint made mac and cheese with hot dogs and for dinner. Um, and it was actually really good. <laughs> because we're five, apparently. Sometimes mac and cheese is just a good meal never had it i mean it's just past just a, a pasta and a cheese sauce it's like a, a staple here funnily enough it was like one of those cheap dishes that i used to eat when i was 
uh, that when we were little. Um, but it's actually really expensive to make it now because cheese is so expensive. Um. I just wrote real. Okay. All right. Um. So I know what I did wrong here. Why does this this feels really weird today? I don't know why. So what I had wrong was This bit. Hi, Ollie. That's still going really slow. over there for now. I didn't think the length of... Ew, I have sweat dripping down my back. It's so gross. Um, you, you didn't need to know that, but you do now. You're welcome. Quasel. Hi, Toast. Wait, why is... Quasel. Oh, that is like that. All right. I didn't think the axle length mattered. But let's just, uh, let's just test it out. Do I need to like gear it down again? I mean, I can. I don't know if it'll help. I just suppose it's only a breeze right now. Okay, so really what I want to do here... Did 
it to No, let's move that back one more. I keep forgetting to put the last of my beer in the fridge. No, come back. Bonk, bonk, bonk. I'm not entirely sure what the plan is for this, to be honest. <clears throat> I feel like maybe I need to make this up higher though. because it's just a little too cramped in here. some dirt oh I not have any dirt blocks all right let's get some dirt how many of I start building without dirt who does that oh oh my peanuts are doing well I don't know how the fish is still alive at this point. Magic. I accidentally chopped down a tree that had one of them like hidden log things in and I'm just like absolutely gutted because that means like rubies from that tree. There we go. Uh. Wait, is that... there 
picked up these shitty flint tools, so I may as well use them. Listen. You didn't bring me ice cream, so I'm going to be mean. If I need to bear in mind I only have one set of sails on this windmill So I don't, I don't know if I should worry about this. I mean, I suppose I, I can always. Do another inside to outside. I could repeat that again. And then I need to decide where I want to put the polarizer. I can bring it down there. It sounds like a use it for a kid's show also i want to figure like i want to do the the hopper thing but i haven't figured out how that works yet Abandon, hell yes. Honest, mm, you know what? Let's put that on the back end of it. Just a no, like so. I guess that would go there.
Is it backwards? I don't I don't know if there's a a right or a wrong way to place that. It seems like it's backwards. It feels like it ought to be like that way. Wait. I don't know, that seems to make the most sense though, right? I'm gonna put those in the air. <laughs> like that's going at Gale. Yeah, we clearly we we are clearly losing and all those. I think we might just have to do it downscale it again. That's that's clearly fine. That's putting out what a hundred kilonewtons. So that's that's doing just fine by itself. So. 
Okay, question. Honeybee. Maybe. Do I need to take it from the outside in or the inside out? Like outside edge and then down into the middle or center to the outside? I drew a diagram, but I don't know where I put it. I periodically go through my notebook and like rip out pages when I when they're full of scribbly notes. And apparently I didn't check. My scribbly notes this time. Oh, that's that's all okay. right. It is inside to outside itch, right? It is. Hi, Carter. While I was looking. Oh, hi, it me, Del. Would you do me a favor, please? Oh, go take your fancy some water, read a book. Just invest what in I do. Oh, I can Here's see how that would work. Why are you gonna? Why are you gonna do that? Hi, it's me, Fake Dell. I don't know why it sounds different. I don't know. It sounds terrible to me. But I don't know why, unless it's some weird compression thing, why it would sound different. It was literally recorded in OBS.
I'm worried if I like add the too much power, it's just gonna get silly. It's too hot for turnips. It's just two more weeks till I go on vacation. Not that I'm counting. <laughs> not just, not just me. I have all my OBS all set up so I can just like run it from Dean's computer. Did you go back to the other, um, the, the stable build, Revy, from the release candidate? Gotcha. Oh, that's weird. I was getting annoyed with them because I accepted a key that was offered, so I didn't have a requirement to make content. It was a play then decide. And then And then they fuss at me. Uh, for not making content. And when I looked, I had like 60 days. And basically every, every week they emailed me like, hey, you haven't made content yet. It's like, look. <laughs> 
And every time they emailed me, it made me want to play it even less. Yeah. Oh. All right, so I need more reason before I can do anything. Carter out here solving everyone's problems just like that. You're so good at this, Carter. Or just problem. I am now convinced that part of the problem I'm having is I mean it's different and it's one more one more thing to juggle so I can understand that Totally understand that. Oh, good. You get on that. At least it's not a problem that it's available, in which case, I guess you can't. I mean, I'm sure you could talk to Drax about it, Ravi. He, uh, I think he basically dual streams everything now. It's one of those things that I keep on being like, hey, I should do that. If only just so I don't have to like upload everything afterwards. And I know there's like things that you can use, like there's there are pretty good ways to combine chat now so that you don't have to look at different chat windows. <laughs> Ravi, that was a very good catch.
But we'll add an extra sail. I may just need more power. <clears throat> no, I mean, I understand that. If anything, you could consider that a an added value proposition for Twitch. So, a, a sort of incentive for people to to move from youtube to twitch would be to play those would have those integrative games perhaps or in itself the lack of bells and whistles could be considered a, a bonus too because some people don't want that stuff so like one of the things that Drex does is he talks about how if you want to watch a stream without music, YouTube is good for that. So you have options. I think I am just gonna have to get more sales. Okay, I need more resin. Let's let's do the the, the shopping list before I get confused. Hey, I, I keep feeling like I'm being watched, and then looking over at the mic, and you know, there's little googly eyes staring at me. May have been a bad decision. I mean, obviously, I am being watched. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Well done. Are you sure about that? Somebody's watching you. Um, what else do you need? Resin and flax. Okay, we're just going to put all these things away.
The frustrating thing is if I kept all this at the level of the windmill, it would be fine. But because I've brought it so far down, it is not fine. I mean, I deliberately have the emote spam twice, like two overlays, so it doubles up. So... And I also have um, the actual emote spam with the trigger words. <laughs> hmm. Sad. I, I don't, but I will. Yes, I will be back in a few minutes. Uh, where's the thing? Here's the thing. Okay, bear back.
All right. Uh, so reason and flex. Fuck. Why didn't I plant flex? A long, long time ago. That is my question. Oh, so I have a shitload of flax seeds. I should just plant them. Rather than just doing a few at a time. Maybe so. Ow. Look, the microphone needs to stop staring at me. All right, I have 36 flag seeds. So let's go get some medium fertility soil. I'm not arguing with high fertility stuff right now. But we can definitely find some medium. Get this flax planted. Can I find medium? I swear it's like everywhere until I'm looking for it. Oh, and chickens! Oh. We need chickens too. Am I going the wrong way for the medium dirt? Oh no, there's some. No, that's forest floor. Urgh. Honey. What Ready, have party. I done? Drax? Oh. Hello. Hi. Welcome to Delco's Hunting for Dirt. Oh, hi! Hi, Molly! Thank you for the giant bee! <laughs> hi, Drax! Molly! Hello! Hi! Dirt is your favorite? I had heard that. 
I'm like, I don't, I don't need dirt. Whatever. No, I need dirt. Because someone didn't plant enough flax. <gasps> Molly! Donkey Delirey, one dink, donkey Delirey, one dink, donkey. Delirey, one dink, donkey to you too. Thank you. Don't forget to the car. I feel like this is not the right way to get medium dirt. Well, we're doing okay. Though I... I have a, an underpowered windmill, which is making me sad. Because I decided to build the windmill very, very, very high up. I mean, build a really long axle all the way down. And then by the time it's got to the bottom, there's like no power. So now I'm scrabbling for reason so I can make more large wheels so that I can like do the large wheel to small wheel thing. Well, like gear it down or whatever. It's not that it's too hi it's that my base is too low yeah so that's the only way i can think of to 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 get enough power to actually work but also the windmill isn't even at half power so i'm like should i try and get more sails and then mess with the talk. Yeah. Yeah. And it's it's like I I'm like okay I got it I understand what I need to do. And then my brain's like, I no, don't. The fuck of course you, you don't no one knows what they're bloody doing and then i get confused so now i'm looking for some medium dirt so i could plant all of my flax seeds <sighs> which you know i should have done months ago But like, why would you plant a garden when you first arrive? Whatever. But this is... But yeah, basically I don't even have enough power to do the pulverizer right now. So... I either have to apply more power at the top or do the talk thing. Yeah, if you wouldn't mind, just stand up top and just blow on it. Like it, it, in a gale, it, it will occasionally boop, but that's it. <sighs> but yeah, I need to. It needs more power. And that that's that's on me because we're at what? 111 height. My coffee is really good today. I don't know why.
Oh. Did my game just crash? Nope, I was just thinking about it. So we've gone from 111 to... Yeah. Almost 100 units difference. So... I'm not really surprised that there's a loss in power. <laughs> but thanks. Or I need, yeah, I need more sales. I think once the sales are going, it'll be fine. But I still need to do the talk thing. Oh, maybe there's some... Uh -uh. I don't think there is any medium dirt up here. There's a bear, there's bears and goats and all sorts of stuff up here. I still haven't planted my cherry trees either. Wait, is that flax? No goat, well that we know of. Bears and goats and bears and goats and bears and goats. And a cow. Well, there's there's no time like the present. Other than tomorrow, tomorrow is always good. I thought I saw some more flags. Honestly, kind of more scared of the goats and the bears at this point. So there is a couple of clusters of flax, but they're not ready. So I don't I don't know what the easiest way is. Like just to go roaming and look for a bunch of flax. Or Plant it and then just do something else for 40 days and 40 nights. Because everything hinges on me being able to use a polarizer. So what I'm probably going to do instead is go uh, nothing. I'm not going to do anything that would be vaguely useful and instead I'm just going to end up going exploring. I have and I didn't have much luck but maybe I was like looking in the wrong place. Like the last time I went out on a big explore I think I only found like five things. But then I suppose finding it in ruins is probably... more feasible than finding it elsewhere. But yeah, I mean I have like 30 something seeds so I should just plant them. Just don't look for it, yeah. Just look for something else. Look for 10. I don't need to look for 10. Right now, I'm just trying to find some medium fertility soil, and apparently I can't even do that.
I have a bunch of high fertility soil, but I don't want to use it until I'm ready to commit. Which is, you know, a problem. A problem that I have. And everything I'm seeing is like, oh, 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 forest floor, forest, forest floor. Like, fuck you, forest floor. Why are you going to be like that? So right now, then, uh, I'm not looking for medium dirt and I'm not looking for flax. I'm not looking for the winning lottery ticket numbers. <clears throat> it just gave me more flax. I think you might only have like one or two of those to use a day. Brickley. Nicely played. Well done. I guess it's better than 877 cash now. I should be picking all of these berries. Imagine winning something using those numbers. Like, how cool would that feel? Even if it was like five bucks, I'd be like, fuck yeah. That's, that's the best part. It's the side quests are the best part. He started playing Stardew. Amazing. Oh, did you see the Ali linked to game in the general chat channel? It kind of has Stardewish vibes, but like sci-fi. Might be one that you guys would enjoy. It's Flex over there. Ah! Medium dirt. Well, I mean, if I have to... Yeah, you have fun with that. I think I've even got to year two. My attention span just goes, uh, nah, I'm done. Uh, in the general game stuff channel, I think. It's called Little, Little Known Galaxy. I don't know why I'm being so stingy with the high fertility soil.
Just like, man, it's 19 degrees. It sounds amazing. Um. Oh, uh. <clears throat> puts on professional streamer voice. Uh. For those of you who came over with Drax's raid, I totally didn't forget to introduce myself. I was just seeing if you were paying attention. Um, hi, I'm Dal. Deloria. My pronouns are she, her, and I'm playing Vintage Story. Um, it's totally fine. Oh, that sounds amazing, Ali. Uh, I, I like playing games on the internet. We think the, um, okay, that's, that is enough. We think the AC on our van is starting to die out. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Also, I have a new friend. Bonjour, mon, Monsieur Le Pouf. I, I had to. Rex. Yeah, Flint's city, he thinks we can get it done pretty cheaply. Um, we definitely need to. My, my initial knee-jerk creation was my name is, and then just like a string of curse words, which is totally inappropriate uh, when trying to create a welcoming space <laughs> I was like oh no don't say that doll don't say that oh you can't say that either no you definitely can't say that one <laughs> Aussie welcome Ah, fuck. Yeah, no, I'm not going to say the Aussie Aussie welcome because I might, I might offend someone. I'm still mildly, actually no, not mildly, quite amused by the fact that I, I nearly ended up welcoming someone into, welcoming a raid last week like Molly did. Oh no, now I'm just thinking about the, 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 the kettle person in, yeah, <laughs> in, in, uh, Manor Lords, whose name was Hunt. tell you it was rough digestive distress midstream is no bueno Okay, so we've got some, we've got some dirt. We're gonna, I don't know where I am. Is 
Can I go plants? <laughs> yes. Yes, I meant that one. I'm far too easily entertained. Far too easily entertained. These things always sound far more entertaining in my head than when I say them out loud as well. Good. All right. Um, I'm, I feel like I'm being so like lazy taking shortcuts when there's no one else on the server and I'm just be like, ah, fuck it. I'll just sleep through the night. fine oh i keep thinking about that game actually like it's it's not often after i've played a game <laughs> um we're you know i'm like huh i don't know how to go back and play that again Wait, do I have backup snacks? I think I've almost eaten all the, the uh, candy that Toast made. Oh no, I still have plenty. And I have some salt now, I think. All right. Where am I going to plant the flags? Oh, I have 40 seeds now. Which is eight by five. I'm going to plant it out here so I don't have to worry about messing with lighting. Oh no! <laughs> well that's awkward. I mean I could just... Right. Oh look, here, this'll do. Let's do it here. No, stop it. keep thinking about that new MMO that, that I saw posted about and that it's not like it's own it's not even got a release date yet. But I'm just like, no, oh, I wanna play it. But it's not ready to play yet. There's definitely bunnies out here. 
Uh, you don't want to make it easy for them? Just empty it? Oh boy. That reminds me, I need to, to, uh, shit, um, oh, my cow grew up. I need to finish a sentence. I need to clean the filter. In my AC. Hopefully, it's helping post the dehumidifier. Oh, that's good. Look, if you could stop with that bullshit, I'd appreciate it. Hey. So I was I was working on the lawnmower yesterday for a couple of hours. And I ended up stopping because I was I was sweating so much that I couldn't see. Like it was just like it was so gross. I just gave up in the end. I'm like, I'm done. <laughs> And it wasn't particularly, you know, like, it wasn't physically exhausting. It was just messing around with a few, you know, a few wrenches and screwdrivers and shit. But, ugh. Doing now what I should have done when I first started. I posted a picture in the gallery of the uh, what the, the the state that the old blade was in. I don't think I connected the springs properly for the choke though, so I have to take the filter off and check it again. But I I ran out of existence. I was like, no, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Hmm. Hello, cow. But I got most of it done, and there was a job that I'd been putting off for a couple of months. So. And now everything's on there. It's, you know, it's easy enough to fix. Ma'am? 
I'm ow. Jesus. So moody. Get it? Moody? <laughs> moody? <clears throat> Sorry, ma'am. She, she didn't like that I did that. All right. So Flex is installed. Installed? Planted. Flex is planted. I swear if she chases me inside. So maybe we do just need to go exploring. <clears throat> Especially because like I know now I don't feel shitty but like I know that um I can fight the the critters and they won't fight back which means that I've got a better chance of getting more of the of the temporal gears, but that feels cheesy. Um, okay, what I need to do is where's the salt? Here's the salt. Let's just do a little bit of cooking before I go anywhere. I think I have enough points. Yeah, so I'll get more food per craft. Make a chilly Mac. Hello. Hi, big ham. Um, I don't know where to put that, so I'm just gonna put that there. Alright, so we're gonna roast some peanuts. Oh, you know what I ought oh, shit. I have all this food that's spoiling. I should just cook up a batch of stews and stuff. Right. Instead of com coming back and complaining that I'm hungry and then just eating berries. <laughs> right? Yeah. Right. Or I could just run around with the raw ingredients out of my bag. No, I'm going to use them because I, I don't like wastage. It. 
so instead I'm gonna make delicious delicious wait is it even gonna work Oh. Ten servings of smoked red meat stew with boiled carrots. And black currants. Bonk. I've got plenty of crops. Okay, I'm gonna do the same over there because then I can just like stack them together. All right, this has now become a cooking show. Yeah, I I, I am very lucky that that lawnmower blade didn't break. Also, it explains why the lawns are looking a bit sad because I guess with it being bent, because it was bent downwards, I was basically plowing the ground as I was mowing with it. So, yeah. But I didn't realize how much had worn away until I compared the new blade to the old. So once I get it working, it should do a great job now with a lot less resistance. Look at that, can check on the oven and both fire pits at the same time. And that, that bend was lit, you know how you get those little like reflective cat slides that they put in the middle of roads just to help mark off the, 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 the gap between two lanes? <clears throat> they installed a heap of those in our on our street and it, they didn't last, I don't know, but a week before they all just came away. And I was like, I wonder where they'd gone. It turns out when they flip upside down. So all you're seeing is the, like all the reflective stuff is buried in the grass. You can't see them. They're not very visible at all uh, until you hit them with a lawnmower. And and then it's easy to, to notice them. I made a bloody awful noise. I don't know how many of these I'm going to need. Oh, 
Oh, I don't have any animal fat. Oh well. Make some turnip, turnip. Uh, carrot and cabbage stew. Mmm, delicious. Oh, apparently, I think that is delicious. Wait, where is my... Right there. Ah, quit it. I hate it when that happens, you know, when you're trying to eat and the door keeps opening and closing. So that was what? Turnip, turnip, carrot and cabbage. Rotting turnip, turnip, carrot and cabbage. I don't think that's going to be hot enough to do it. Delicious. Hopefully this will last longer. It was really tough trying to decide what I wanted to do today, actually. I was very... It was sort of evenly torn between this or Project Zomboid or Assassin's Creed. It really is fun just to, like, run around like a complete menace. Maybe. Will the oh, I don't think they'll eat it. I don't think the cows will eat it. It's nice being able to make more servings at once, but the problem is it takes longer. Like, the more you make, the longer it takes. It's such a cozy sound. The uh, the lids bubbling away. Surely this is going to be the last round that works. It is. It's a very very comfy sound. 
It's a sort of sound that I can sort of... I don't know why I related to that, because it's not one that I have, but you know, like, just sort of being curled up in bed, like as a, a, a small person, like homesick from school or something, and just hearing household sounds. Like that and like the washing machine or the sewing machine is like background noises. Yeah, I don't think those peanuts are gonna be hot enough there. Oh no, Mon Monsieur Le Pouf is shedding. Buddy! Do not do that, please, all over my desk. Now I know what it's like to have a cat. Oh, did not think that was going to work. Try another four. So that's 19 servings. Need another one. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like, just... Just comes over. Sheds on my desk, fucks off, stares at me without actually indicating what they want. I don't know why we have to have things with French names, you know, like yeah, the the croissant, but I guess that makes sense. I don't know why the the mic is now Monsieur Le Perth, but it is what it is. Seems a shame to use the cabbages. Look, of course, you can't use berries like that. Why would you do that? Well, they may not be sealed. But it's better than letting the food go to waste. Look, why, why won't you let me do that? Fine. We have turnip, 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 and cabbage soup. It'll be delicious. I forgot I've got all that candied fruit too. Oh shit. Didn't forget I had all that. Uh I guess it was a good thing I made a bunch of crops, huh? I 
right, we have ads starting in 30 seconds. Oh, good time to stand up and stretch. Go to the loo, grab a snack, grab a battle snack. Nothing else is going to look like I'm very organized. Mmm, delicious. I love rotting turnip stew, it's my favorite. So I'm gonna need... Whoop. Oh, I just reset the temperature, that's frustrating. Orc rocks. Very, yeah, very earthy. So I've got a bunch of berries still that I need to process because these are going off. So I guess I need to make a bunch of juice. Who that once this is done? I, can't, I don't want to multitask or I'm going to end up getting confused. I don't understand why my coffee is so good today. I've done nothing different than usual. I hate when I get distracted part way through things and forget what I'm doing. I actually did mean to take a break then. I just kind of missed it. Sorry. Raining party! One human. Hello! Hi! Oh, more fallout! So my hello, just a hi, wine, hello, dark. Hi, welcome in. It's going very well, thank you. Wayne, thank you for the raid. You've just joined us on a, a mad turnip stew frenzy. Oh, hi, Molly. Fancy seeing you here. We are, we are doing all the cooking. Um, <laughs> it's it's all about the turnips. Oopsie. All about the turnips. 
um but hello welcome in everyone who came with wine um I, uh, hi, I'm Dal or Deliria, my pronouns are she, her, and this is me pretending to be a human while I play Vintage Story. Thank you for the follow! Stop eating the berries! Keep eating the berries. Um, how was Fallout? How was your stream? I would love to hear about it. At least, of course, you need to run away and go do, like, post-stream defragging and stuff, in which case, please do that, because that's important. Um, yes, my intention was to build a windmill. Uh, so obviously, what I'm doing right now is cooking. Because that's how this game works. We found a third suit of power armor and unlocked loot. Woo! The endurance is so nice. That's awesome. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Exactly. Just, you know... Things, things happen, and then other things happen. And then the next thing you know, something else has happened. Hi, Nadia! When I max out all of your st base stats except keep your charisma and luck at one star, is this like a a fun role play thing, or are you just in getting entertained by the uh, the different results you can get? I'm just gonna eat the cranberries. Grizzless luckless adventurer, love it. Uh, yes, that is. That is 100% the appropriate and expected response to someone encountering bells for the first time. I I started doing that in... Um, Soma. Honestly, I kind of thought that to myself and I'm like, I'm not going to put that out loud in the world. Um, I tried doing a low intelligence run in uh, Outer Worlds. I didn't get very far in, but it was actually really funny. I was like, man, it's a good thing this is in the 90s. If I said I was going to eat the cranberries, someone might get upset. Um... Man, Outer Worlds is one I want to come back to at some point. That was a fun game. <laughs> hey, Onyx. Yeah. It does. It does. It's, um, hi. Well, raid welcome, Onyx. I think doing that sort of thing for stream especially, it helps give like a focus. So you've kind of got like the big goals and then the little goals and you can kind of use them all as stepping stones. So if you get to a situation where you're like, I don't know what to do, you can be like, okay, well, what would a person with these stats do? And it makes it a, a little easier for decision making, I think. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that yet. Yeah.
Buckets, 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 buckets. Oh, well, thank you. I don't, I don't have much to show at the moment here. It's, it's kind of dark. Um, but right, I have a, a cave home right now. I, I built a little home inset into the, the cave. And I think everything is like better because uh, it's full full colors. Um, but it's <laughs> it's uh, it's very much not finished, even a little bit right now. Oh, cool. My, my kitchen isn't anywhere near as big as I want it to be. Oh, I know what I can do. Whew, there we go. So yeah, kitchen is, is still a work in progress. Um, in fact, it's all kind of still a work in progress, but this is my little, my little bedroom. There's nothing in there yet. Storage. It, it, it's all very bare bones. with my little cave garden here, but the plan is eventually to have it so that these cave mouths um, are all like filled with trees. The windows you can make, those are base game. Um, and I haven't actually tried the, that mod yet. I haven't used any of it yet. Um, I keep forgetting about it, to be honest. <sighs> Alright, so one, two, whoopsie. That's okay. Hey, whatever works. There's no there's no rules about how you play this as long as you're enjoying it. Now we are mass producing. Let's take the wood out. Red carrot syrup. Oh, do I want to make syrup or wine? Rex is like wine. Is it even a question? I'll just use my leftover tanning bucket. It'll be fine. Easy answer, yeah. It'll just have little bits of, you know, stuff in it. Oh, in which case,
stop eating the fruit. Oh my. Okay, we'll make we'll make some red currant wine. help but eat the leftover bits that up here just for storage I think that should deal with like most of the uh the raw produce that i have in here like if anything else goes off that's not a big deal i don't think really just pop them in my bag i'll just eat the last rotting turnip it's like the last unicorn but Less sad, I guess. All right, so we've got I don't know if why are you staking? I don't know what those are going to do. I'm just going to put them all in there. I'll be done with it. Oh, oh, I've got the brandy in the teacups already. All right. Okay, so we've got what? What have we got? What are we doing? It's my, my, it's too hot for turnips. Okay, peanuts are growing, the soy is growing. I can't get over how bright it is in here with these, these lights, light shafts that I made. Oh, I've got blueberries still and white currants. We have to harvest the blueberries. Um, maybe I should make blueberry brandy. And it'll look pretty too, which is very important. I'm running out of space here. All right, we're just gonna start storing wine and upstairs. It'll be fine. It'll be totally fine. It's not going to make a lot. It'll be a limited reserve. <laughs> oh, fuck. I hate when that does happen. When that. Whoop. 
when that happens. Such a vibrant color. It's not going to be enough to do anything. It's so pretty. Okay. I don't have any blueberry syrup, so we're just going to eat the blueberries. Okay. Now, I thought we were done, but we're not done. Now we have to go grind the grind the peanuts. <sighs> To make peanut paste and then we have to make peanut butter I'm so looking forward to getting this windmill going I should go grab the other nuts that I have. And then I need to figure out how to do the, the thing with hoppers and stuff. Since I got a bunch of like copper shoots and things. I've got so many metal plates that I can make a bunch as well. In fact, I think I still even have some copper roof tiles that I've not used. It's really disconcerting having a pair of eyes like a few inches from your face just like staring at you. Now I'm like, maybe I need to like spray paint my mic green so it gets keyed out and then put the fuzzy cover back on it. I 
and then make it so it's visible on stream. All right, so then we take that. Here. If I can remember how to do this. You can't, you don't eat the syrup yet, right? I think that it comes afterwards. Man, that sounds really good. Peanut butter made with black currant syrup. I'd eat that. Alright, so that's like super duper high power. Okay, that's empty that I wanted. This should do it. This should get us set up for a while anyway. And then I'll have a stack of delicious candy to go exploring with. I should never go exploring without candy. Oh no, I still need to get automation in my kitchen as well. It's going to be fun with water underneath me. Are we gonna hear I'd have excited to have peanut butter again.
Okay, and then we get some sunflower seeds. I really wish you could add dried fruit to that. Candy fruit. Pretty sure you still can't. But it would have been really cool if you could. Sucks. Man, you should totally be able to add candied fruit. Candied fruit. Oh. I'm so glad I remember the process. I put this fruit away. This should give me a good amount for today anyway. Fresh for 87 days. So I guess we go exploring when I get food. Where do we go? It's October, so if I go too far north, I'm gonna hit. Oh. That wasn't what I wanted to do, but sure. I'm going to end up hitting uh, snow. But then I could get ice and accelerate, I guess. I put points into the thing that I didn't want the points into. gonna start spitting candy out shortly. Now it is floor candy. Delicious. should keep us going for the day I reckon. Considering I know I'm gonna end up doing some you know a death warping. Wait. 
Man, I've been through a shitload of firewood, Dan. Um. Oh, you know what? I just realized somewhere in here. Maybe. To bring those with me. Here. If I'm out exploring, I should take the better bed with me, especially with it being darker. I'm also going to take a stack of clay with me so that I can convert stones to cobblestone if I need to. It's a good inventory saver. Do I need a backup pick? Oh. I only have one backup. Oh god, I've got a little polarizer parts here. I still have a good amount of tin. I was like, you know what? I don't need to do it, but it makes me really nervous going out without uh if I take that not having a pick back at home. So let's get that sorted. Get an extra pick maze. I might have one still somewhere, but I can't remember. I can't remember what the workable temperature is. Let's just try this. Did I 
use. Oh. You know what? That's fine. I forgot I'm onto iron tools, actually. I. Mind. Okay. So. Potential traveling north, however, I'm pretty sure all my clothes are fucked. So I have no temperature protection. Nor do I have any furs. Oh, well, I have some. I like that I've got the top hat on top of my helmet there. I don't think I actually think I've got any armor here either. Salads, yum. We had mac and cheese with diced up hot dog. It was, it was very fancy, very grown up. Actually, we haven't had, hadn't had mac and cheese in a while, and it was just nice for a change. Oh, my hair is bothering me immensely. All right. Fresh for 14 days? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to eat so much food. And because I used rotting turnips? <laughs> Like, is this really better than just... Uh... Eating the raw food? I don't know. Alright, what have I got? I have gears in case I come across anything interesting. I have a bed. <coughs> Backup tools. We're running away from home to join the circus.
I kind of like how this looks with the garden being raised, but still with the fence around it. Um, okay, so our options are we can travel and go to the south. Um, which immediately puts us in like safari kind of place. Uh savannah or we can travel like from here we could just go like northeast up this way Should I take a torch or a fire starter with me? Probably. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like knowing my luck. Choices, choices. Hi, Stone. I saw you were playing Minecraft earlier. I hope you had fun. Right. Glad to hear it. I'm okay, thanks. I'm totally not counting down the days until my big adventure. In like two weeks. much much excited I can't even remember the last time I was away from home even like overnight so it's gonna be So no funny business? Wait, I mean, isn't that the fun bit? The funny business? Goofing off? I really... Man, again, I'm like, you know, Minecraft is one that I, I ought to go back to at some point. I haven't played it in years. Only super serious, yeah. Only grown-up funny... Oh, that sounds like something else. Grown-up funny business. I don't know. I'm pretty sure most of the kids I know have more integrity than most of the adults. But yeah, I haven't played Minecraft in in a long time since since like my first year of streaming, which was like 84 years ago. But I don't I don't know. I think it would be, <laughs> I think it would be like really weird going from this to Minecraft. I don't know what that means, really. 
Like, I know there's, like, different flavors. There's, like, Java and... I don't know, banana or something. <laughs> it's really neat, right? Me too. I know there's no such thing as banana flavored Minecraft. But now I want, like, I don't know, a coffee martini. So what, what practical impact does that have playing without Java? Is it more responsive or less mods or explain it to me like I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I think I have like various versions of it on multiple platforms now. I didn't... Oh, okay. I didn't mean to, like, call you out for that, by the way. I'm sorry if I made you uncomfortable. I was just like, oh, Stone's playing Minecraft. How cool. Sometimes I just, like, I open my mouth and my tongue wobbles and words come out and then I'm like maybe there should be a thinking step in there somewhere before the words come out there was a drag raid, yes and now you're here ha ha get wrecked That'll teach you for <laughs> brain, brain, like, oh my gosh, yes, yeah, a brain. Lane. But now you're here twice. We are doing an explore. I did a bunch of cooking. Double Dell. Sounds terrifying. I think one Dell is enough. I don't think we need two, two Dells. So, double Dell could mean like twice the games I could play. Ooh, Risen. I'm just ignore. Thanks. And Olivine. Oh, interesting. Okay. I'm assuming when they combine the versions, it'll end up being the one with Java. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. Man, my throat's sore lately. So, does does my mic sound any different? Thank you, Brigley. Yes, sip sip. And I'll sip sip when my straw is hiding from me. Here we go. Mm. I forgot I put ice cubes in there. Whew. 
Okay, so we're scouting for... Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Ricky's like, tell, it's fine. It's fine. You can stop stressing about it. We're scouting for reason, which I'm not going to find while I'm in the water. And... Flex. Which I'm also not going to find while in the water. And then just like interesting places to explore. That, that is one of the downsides to using a, a raft in this, is that you probably end up bypassing a lot of really interesting stuff. Peace. Maybe I'll have to find a, a sentence full of plosives and uh, do some testing. Loops. Seeds? No, I don't care about seeds. Hmm. Yeah, so reason only spawns on pine trees or acacia trees I think and only like naturally grown ones but you can there is like a like a tap device that you can stick on a pine tree and it'll like with with a mod and then it'll produce the resin that you need kind of like the maple maple syrup taps something down there no flex you can plant um and grow it's just that i didn't plant it soon enough So now I'm stuck hunting for it. Yeah. A metal bed, that sounds comfy. So take a break and I will see you back in a few minutes.
Right. Oh. Wait. Why would you show me a body and not have anything under it? That's just rude. Fourteen. Ooh, you barely made it. Well. I guess that was a ruin. Oh, well, in that case, that's a huge success. Good job. I love that emote so much. So cute. Nope, nothing there. Alright, well... I have to go down here now. Oh. Mind. <laughs> or not. That was the one we just excavated, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's so pretty. Isn't isn't it gorgeous? Like this is this is when the game gets me. Like with the the cute aggression. It's just so heck and pretty. Like, honestly, this would be a great little place to build. On this little peninsula. This little horn. Because you've got a bunch of different biomes here. You've got, like, redwoods and pines. And the ocean. Not that I need more places. It does. It does look like a little beak. Hey, bunny. Oh. However, rainfall in this area is very common. Which means that it's going to be loud. The lake is... Oh, yeah. <gasps> you know what it makes me think of? Skeksis. Hmm, Skeksis. Yeah, I love the fling. Holy crap, it got dark fast. Oh, I, I can't build another place yet. I'm not ready to commit to a second home. Well, this isn't helpful. How am I supposed to explore when it's dark? What are, how long does this let me sleep? Nine and a half hours. It's fine. I can. Well, I can still see the map. I think I might have gone to bed too early. Then when you go to bed too early and then you wake up too early. Oh, we good. Yeah. Right. 
for every day. Oh no. All right, so we need to go north. Sailing. Boom, there's a thunderstorm. Seems perfectly full. What is this going on here? That looks fascinating. Curious little rock formation. Oh, we can watch the sun come up through the clouds. And maybe we won't get hit by lightning. It's, it's, it's he can, he can rainy. Ooh. It's still looking at me. I don't think we're going to get much of a sunrise today with this rain. Rude. I love, man, I just love how it's like carved out here. like interesting little places because you can see it that same carb goes down that way That's better. Now I can see her. Oh, now it's clearing up. Perfect. So from a distance, you can kind of see flex. It kind of has like a grayish blue tint to it. And it stands out on its own. So kind of like that stuff there above my character's name, but like in a, a lesser density. Actually, the fall season is a really good time to go looking for materials because there's a looking for plants because there's a really good old contrast between like the earthy tones of the foliage and then like the the bright colors for uh, 
the crops. We don't want Not ready for riot. Always intrigued by big legs. to push then. Ooh, interesting. No, look. No, to be fair, I found some really cool ruins underground. So maybe we should go. I mean, you say that. <laughs> and I find a translocator. Eat that. Hey, Mark. I guess I'm luck I it I'm just lucky enough to find that, huh? Sticks. You know what? I'll take it. That probably means that there's <clears throat> more interesting stuff down here. There's definitely something down there. Nah, I'm just just nosing around at this point.
just randomly exploring. Let's see what we can see. And to see how long it takes before I get hopelessly lost. But the good news is that translocated was like quite close to the surface there. Oh, this is going to be one of those cave systems. Ooh. Offer. Oh. There is absolutely no rhyme or reason as to why I'm taking whatever turn it is that I take. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> We're never getting out of here. Never. Never. We live here now. What ha? Just a quick peek, says Prickly. Just a quick little peek. It'll be fine. It's, it's totally fine. Where are we at? 46. We're pretty... Far down. Ooh. Hi, Sadie. Hello. <gasps> Whoa. See what I tell you. This is Emilio, a.k.a. Hello. That's Emilio. With a friendly reminder, please Whoa. take some time for yourself. Do a stretch. Take your vitamins or medication. Have a siesta fiesta. Take a walk. And don't forget, be kind to yourself. What the heck? What is this? We... We're doing a he can explore. We're doing a big he can explore. Are those in better condition? 15%? No, minor. Um, but we're doing all right. Yeah. Uh. Oh, that looks good. Um, we have a new friend on stream, Sadie. I can I can kill them. Yeah, hang on. We do. Yes. I from what I understand, it's a it's a legal obligation to put googly eyes when you use a fuzzy wind cover on your mic.
I mean, I could be wrong, but that's just, that's what I heard. No, look, why? Uh. Like, it's fine. I know I can. Oh, no, why? Why? I know I can fight them. But just because I can, doesn't mean I should. Right? Yeah. What was that for? Okay, we're just going to ignore them. Because that's a sensible thing to do. Oh, I'm going to take that. If you just ignore the things you don't like, they go away, right? Oh, I've been in here already. Okay. <laughs> All right. Why am I taking the windows? I don't particularly care about the windows. They're not the right wood color. Oh, my fuck. I just keep going in circles. Okay. Look, stop looking at me. It's a soul blade. Ugh. All right, it's fine. Everything is fine. Ooh. It's yeah. It's it's totally fine. Alchemist pants. Copper Ooh, bookshelves. It is pretty cool, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's very far underground. Very 
because I'm at uh, 46 uh, blocks and ground level in this game is around 12. Uh, and the surface is around 100 and something. Okay, I think that's kind of it though. So I'm gonna put the windows... Yeah. I'm trying, I'm trying to make space in my inventory for, like, useful stuff. Honestly, even the copper pickaxe are really neat. That was a very interesting one. I don't think I've come across that one before. I don't know if I missed something there, but... Well, I'm never gonna find my way back. Like, never. That's, that's the, this is the, the bottom. This is as far down as I can get. This basalt. There is uh, a, a bedrock block, but everything here stops at basalt. Basalt? This turned out to be quite a large system. Oh, heck. This was not the way to come. So I guess at this point we have to decide do I uh, keep on exploring and let myself starve out or uh, And slowly make try and like get up higher. Pretty sure I'm not finding my way out. No. The, um, the ruins are like little... Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Uh... How do I manage that? <laughs> Alright! Yeah, definitely saved by the dirt stairs, a hundred percent. Okay, did not expect that. All right, we're just gonna build. <laughs> thank, thank you. I, I totally knew that was gonna happen. I knew we'd be fine. I just, I was just testing. Sadie! It's two weeks! Ish. Yes. I have, I have. Uh, yes. I can word. Hmm. You know what? I don't need this. What's more welcoming than... An archway of, of dead people in dirt. I'm hot again. I tossed the food that I had. Like, what's down there? Nothing ominous. It's fine. What could go wrong? So ultimately, I'm walking away from those ruins with a bunch of stuff that I don't really need that isn't of any particular use. Wolf was busy. Beer! Hey, beer! Uh, the thing it was chasing, there was a wolf chasing a rabbit. And that's a beer. Just get the crap out of me. I have critters said to be like non aggressive in this. But, uh. Sometimes they, they take offense at your presence still. Money. 
Well, Bunny is stuck in the grass. Oh, that's a lot of them. Baby bunnies! I keep forgetting, forgetting I've got a mod that lets me zoom in. Hands. This is baby goat. Baby cow? I think it's baby cow. Yes, yeah, baby cow. Um, this way. Baby cow to do. Sorry. Let's not pick the poisonous mushrooms. This forest isn't being particularly helpful with its crops. Is a wolf doing a heck and swim? There's some high fertility soil up there. That looks like something. Oh, bloody hell, that's ages away. Oh, that's flax. Swimming beers are pretty amazing as well. None of it's ready to harvest. All right, well, do we have to go check out this ruin? Yeah, we can't not. I'm always really intrigued by underwater ruins. No idea what's going on here. Flex twine, yeah, I'll take that.
bunch of shingles. The current's pushing me around. With that. We don't care about that. We don't care about that. No, give me that. Okay. Well, we got some flags. That's useful. Bunny swimming. There might be flakes over the air. <sighs> oh, whoops. I keep on trying to move to my raft but getting the bed instead and this is not bed knobs and broomsticks i cannot swim on a bed doesn't work like that It's a bunch more. Is it paint? Yeah, it is. I see resin. That's spelled. Man, there's a lot of grains around here. that's being excavated by or if this is just like how it looks So what normally happens with these ruins is they just get randomly spawned like on the landscape. So they can be like Oh, 
Definitely the ones that we got like underground or ones that are sort of partially jutting out. Don't ruin it. I don't ruin it. You ruin it. All right, well, this looks like it's probably the front, right? Or not? I think we're going to have to break in through the ceiling. <sighs> Very itchy foot. I'm going to sit on it. And then maybe it'll go numb and I won't be able to feel it anymore. Oh, there we go. Maybe. What is going on? It's like solid. Normally, if you like dig at the stones that look kind of different, it's it's normally like a bit of an indicator that there's something interesting. Look. Cthulhu. I got so many mosquito bites and I'm, it's so itchy. I was like doing everything I could to resist and now I, I have broken the seal. And now the itch is subsuming me.
All right, this this ruin. Rubbish. Card. I mean, I've got some hydro card, uh, blah, 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 hydro cortisone cream. If I could. Try and slip on there. Like, I knew last night. When I went out. At seven o'clock at night, that if I did that, um, it was going to be a bad idea because seven o'clock at night means all the mosquitoes are coming out to play, and I did not put on my insect repellent. I do have an ice pack, but it's the bites on the arch of my foot, and I'm really sensitive with temperature on my feet. I know it's so rouge. I did. They think I am quite delicious. Rubbish. It's okay. I'll I'll manage, or I'll just grumble about it and say something. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, like I said, I, I, I had a feeling that was going to happen. I mean, they were even going for Flint last night, so they were in a frenzy. Normally, they'll bite Flint like a couple of times and then they'll be like, nah. <laughs> Nick! Hey, Nick! Apparently they don't think Flint is very delicious. Oh. I was having great- I was helping though, because every time a mosquito would land on him that I'd see, I'd slap it. To- obviously to get the mosquito. Because I'm helping. Um, cause I'm just, I'm the, I'm just that nice, you know? Um, he, he didn't seem to think it was super helpful though. Ooh, this is so pretty with all these colors. I am thankful though that when we got into the pool, I did manage to like, I asked, I slipped over as soon as I stepped in and landed on my butt, which was fine because I was in the pool, but it did mean uh, that I didn't get uh, any mosquito bites on my butt, which is great because I hate having mosquito bites on my butt. Purpley looking bush. Um. I don't see anything purpley. Unless you just mean these. Oh, this. 
either. That's one of my favorite flowers in the game. All right, we have Ed starting in 30 seconds somehow already. I don't know how. Some weird timey-wimey shit going on here. Um, so, the time to stand up, stretch, have a break, have a Kit Kat, or not. I'm not your mum, I can't tell you what to do. Um, and I'm going to go to see if I can get some ice on my foot before I tear myself. You foot or something. I hope you see you in a few minutes.
Paper tuned. Hey, my mic. Monsieur Le Pouf? Stay. Alright. Switching over to my hidden seat. It's trying to steal the limelight. Jack. So I couldn't do a, a, an ice pack on my foot, but I did get more coffee and a bag of salt and vinegar chips. Medicinal salt and vinegar chips. Hmm. Ooh, carrots. Ah, oh, so pretty. Oh, come on. This game. Every time I play it, it blows me away with how pretty it is. Every second time. Oh god. Wine. Why is it your fourth wall alert that insists on being awkward all the time? Hmm. They really did. Hmm. Never mind. False accusation. I figured it out. It's fine. How much? Wait, wait, hang on. Wait. Mm. Ow. Oh, hey. I wonder if there's berries around here. Nom 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 berries. I 
keep on feeling thumps. I'm wondering what's going on, but it's just the um passion, I guess, from people leaning off fireworks. That's some interesting rock formations. Ooh, there's a decision. Oh, never mind. I was like, where are we gonna go? Do we wanna go up here? But then there's a big ruin right here. So that's where we're going. Some more that loot or something. I'm trying to make my candy last. Oh, there's a trader up there too. Let's see what the trader has to offer. It's a cathedral. Ooh. That kind of made my tummy bloop just then, so I knew it was fine. Just a little boop. Hey, buddy. A luxuries trader, huh? So, Horace. A gold lantern? Oh, that's kind of cute. That black wallpaper. I'm looking! Jeez, give me a break. Sail 
Those people are so pushy. This terrain is making me nervous. I keep on expecting the ground to just like not be there. So there's this big ruin and then there's one over there. This is going to have scary things in it, probably. Just FYI. Creepy crawlies. So can I really? Can I really? Okay, I can. I mean, worth it just so I can get the flak, the uh, fiber off them. What's up with that dude? Oh! <laughs> Why are you doing that? Okay, they they do. Well, thankfully, I guess. Uh, in in this playthrough on the server, they won't attack you, so you don't need to attack them. Like there's there's nothing to be gained except for maybe some fiber. What is this blue seal? Yeah. There's, there's nothing aggressive here on the server. Occasionally critters will like lash out if they get hurt and you're nearby. But you generally have to like Ooh, yes. Punch them in the face for them to want to do the same to you. Mainly because I'm a big bloody wuss and I, I don't, don't like having to fight things. Okay, so we've, we've cleared this area, right? Yeah. It's a very large ruin. Ow! That was me. So there's this entire... Bit 
here. Oh, and here. Here we go. Wait. Did I? I did go up there. Ow. Okay. Well, that was something, I guess. No, the other one was to the. Well, what's that? Is it just a um, a monolith? Yeah, it's just a monolith. So there is something to where I'm lost now. Brandio's music is, is helping immensely. We're Ooh. A mango. Pomegranate. Redwood seed. Nice. Oh, I'll eat the mango with the pomegranate. Not those. That looks like flax. Oh, Jesus Christ. I... I understand the desire to have fireworks and look at the pretty colors in the sky and getting the the big satisfaction for the big booms and being able to feel it, but I hate it. not good with sudden loud noises especially if there's like a percussive oomph to it as well so probably gonna get pretty jumpy from now on just FYI that's the other reason I switched over to these rather than my earbuds because these are doing do a much better job of locking out sounds I don't like Well, we have them. We have fireworks on New Zealand. Like for Guy Fawkes, we use fireworks. And for New Year's and big sporting events and stuff. Hmm. Um, and in fact, when I was doing bar work, one of my regulars was a pyrotechnician. 
So he would be the one who would set all, you know, when you go to like a sports game and there's like fireworks leading off from around the stadium roof, that was his job. And it never used to bother me, but basically since I've been in the States, I, yeah, I, it, it really just sets me on edge. Yeah, I mean, context makes a difference. Like, when you're expecting things. But, yeah. I mean, as a whole, I just don't do good with loud noises. Like, uh, sirens going down the street, for instance, like an ambulance going past me or a fire engine, just like, makes me cry. I just can't. It's like too much. I remember being being little and I, I, I react the same way now as I did then. When I was four, I basically like cover my ears and if it's too bad or if I'm stuck near them, I start crying. It's just like... I used to get told to stop being silly, which is, you know, reassuring as a child. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't do good with the loud noises. That big one, that was like a mortar though. Like I could feel it in the floor. Ooh, resin, resin. Thankfully. Daisy does not care at all. She is just not fussed and is just accepting of like whatever's going on. She's like, okay, this is how it's supposed to be. <laughs> so like I have her in my room at New Year's Eve when the fireworks are going and it's not for her. It's for me. <laughs> she will just sleep through it all. I've never met such a chill dog. Oh, this is... Oh, this is pretty. Oh, poor baby. I don't know how we lucked out because her her big sister uh donna was actually donna was okay with fireworks but she was she was a lab husky mix she was smart enough to know if she acted a certain way she could get attention so she'd like check to see if anyone was looking the way that a kid does and so if anyone was paying attention then she'd be like oh i'm scared but if no if she didn't think anyone was watching she'd be totally fine but I, yeah i think we just locked out with daisy i know some of it's like socialization when they're a pop but some dogs just don't like noises that's totally fine Oh my god, these chips are so good. Oh. 
Oh. I fell off the ground. I feel like this is going to be a really pretty location as well. Maybe. It's hard to tell at night. Thank God, there's so much copper. We're getting there, slowly. Can I... Are you edible? You are. Is it worth trying to start a fire to cook those? Let's see if we can start a, a fire without starting a forest fire. I don't know, that sounds very unlike me. Oh, no, I actually kind of do want those. I don't know what that blue seal is. I have no idea what it is, so therefore I have to keep it. Blue seal. Oh, it's clothing. Well, that's not very exciting. Next. Roasted charred mushroom just sounds really good. Good for a hundred and three days. I wasn't sure if it was like... A, uh, like a furniture item or like some weird thing.
Yummy! Oh my goodness, I love mushrooms. Imagine just sitting down and chugging a bunch of like delicious buttery fried mushrooms. I would like that. Honestly, I think I'm just going to start eating the grain. Alright, let's go south. No, let's just go continue going west. That'll be fine. It's going to burn itself out. I think. As long as I keep an eye on the mini, mini map for like interesting looking ruins, I think it'll be okay. Excuse you. I'm much more likely to find useful things this way. I really, 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 really wish, I know there was a lot of reallys, that you could grow mushrooms in this game. So if there was like, I don't know, I understand needing to put limits on it, but you could have like you could plant mushrooms and only get like a couple of blooms of each plant or something rather than it just being infinitely regrowable. Well, there's lots of mushrooms. That, there's like so many types of mushrooms in this game, but you can't plant them. Ooh, blueberries. And they're so beautiful, like the artwork is beautiful. I was just like, man, I can't hear the game properly. Maybe I could turn the music down. Here you go. 
So I'm tired through and I'm like, man, the music's been kind of loud, huh? For nearly five hours. Hey, look at that! Those are pretty- I mean, don't eat those ones. The fly algaric so look, they're so pretty. Every time I see those, it makes me think of Skyrim. Oh, there's so many maple trees. I'm good right now. I don't need a lot of food. Actually, I'm very good on food. Can hear running water. What's right there? Oh, this looks like it'll be pretty in the daylight. I sleep late. Huh. Ooh, that's a place to look. No, we gotta go up there. Added by a bear. Oh, oh, all right. Whoa, that's a hell of a view. That's so cool. This almost looks like like the rocks formation on the other side almost looks like it could be a castle. More tunnel. Whoa, that's even better. God, that's gorgeous. Those full colors almost looks like a mushroom patch. There's a ruin up here. Hello, goat.
Oh, it looks like it's frost on those trees. Oh, it's two degrees up here. Was so interesting. Frosty trees. It's honestly just so gorgeous. Thing is there, can we get down? That would be a yes. something over here too right yeah yeah i hear you doing the awoos good job oh wait this could looks like a thing Sure, I'll take the reeds that I don't have to cut up myself. You betcha. Okay, there's a trader this way. Yes, this way. chickens hey stretch it's got an eye patch or a monocle so I don't have any of those things
Just some very earnest tooting. I hear chickens. God. Everything touching my skin is freaking me out right now. Excuse me. Doesn't help that there's a fruit fly in here. attracted to my sweetness or something. Stay, but I saw you on Sadie's monitor, and you look so cute. Oh, I love the way your hair looks. Oh, thank you. One beating heart, Delirey. One beating heart, Delirey. One beating heart. Um, yeah, thank you. That's very kind. I appreciate you. Don't forget to pick a color. If you have the spoons for it. Thank you for your support. <gasps> I can't wait to see you. I am not counting down days. Eey, uncle. Yellow is a good choice. Okay, it is. It is. I wish I could drive to help, but I can't, unfortunately. But that's okay. Oh, oh yeah, I think I remember her saying that. I can, I can sing terrible songs to keep you motivated to make the trip end. Will make you want to kick me out. We can always swap out if Waffles is okay with me as well. I don't mind that. I'm pretty relaxed about that sort of thing. I mean, you've met Daisy, right? Yeah, <laughs> it's like, yeah. She re she usually reflects the energy back that you give her. So, okay, well, we'll we'll see how we go. But yes, I'm I'm very much looking forward to it. Ooh, snow. Okay, have fun. Enjoy your not silly games. Have a wonderful evening. Should I go up and try and, and see if there's any ice up there in the snow? I might end up freezing. That's okay. It's just a little bit of freezing.
I think we'll be okay as long as it doesn't rain. And I have a torch, so I can make fire. Let's have to get up there. And rather conveniently getting the 930 hot flash. So that helps. Ooh. I mean, I snow, but cave. Oh. Hmm. It's gonna be a big cave. I'd rather get lost in it after I've been up top. Yes, no. Actually, this will be a good test to see if this will crash the server. saying snow and not ice so that's a bloody big pine tree minus seven degrees celsius well yeah it's pretty cold all right we have an ad break coming up um this is not a place for me to go afk though because if i go afk here i will probably freeze my little seraph booty off um but please take the opportunity to have a break get a drink grab a snack and once i'm in a safe area i will do the same let's get it to like above zero would be great What is that yellow marker? Oh, all right. Quite a bit further north, more north than I was expecting. Oh, shit. Ow! All right, well, I found my way down quickly. All right, I think I'll be okay here, so I'm going to take an AFK break and I'll see you in a minute or two.
I forgot that I got a fresh coffee. Hmm. Hello! Hi, Echo! How is Echo friend? But am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? All the better for seeing you. We're doing we we doing a hick and explore. Got done with dinner. I hope it was delicious. We had a very grown up dinner before stream. We had mac and cheese with sliced up hot dogs. Ooh, yummy. We are, can't I have like anything with pasta? I'm there. Honestly, it's been so hot in the kitchen this last couple of weeks. Like today it was it was cooler, but it was more humid. And I went out just to put some dishes away and straightened up in the kitchen and it was just exhausting. And I was like, it's too hot to cook anything right now. <laughs> oh no. I got the um I got the blade installed and the carburetor replaced. Um yesterday. But it was so hot. But there was I don't know what I missed. I think a spring may have stretched. So I may have to fix that. A spring that holds the, the choke open when you start it. So I need to pull it apart again, and it was just too fucking hot. Two hours. Oh, jeez. Oh. Yeah. By the time I replaced the blade, put the carburetor on, and then I had to take it off because there was a screw in the way, and I didn't have enough strength in my hand, so I had to bring it into flint. Uh, for him to fix for me. And then... I was just like, I can't do anymore. I didn't even get a chance to do any mowing. <laughs> it was wiped. Probably small but big free rouse. Well, hopefully you can get it sorted soon. Oh, why are they all so far up? diversion through here Ooh, that'd be great that'll be a a, a, a relief to say the least Well, I mean, if I have to.
We found some pretty cool ruins today. Really going all the way down there. Yeah, there was one where I was like, "Ugh, fine, I'll go in this stupid cave. There won't be anything there." And then there was, and I was like, "Well, that'll teach me." Brickley is like, why didn't you go have a peek? And I was like, okay, fine. And then it was cool. It's true. Honestly, tree, you can keep the resin. That's too far up. Pine forest and stony deserts is where it's at. I'm honestly half tempted next time I work on the lawnmower to like just bring it inside. what that is. Yeah, so I, I have enough dirt to get back up, I think, hopefully. And I eat my inventory so I have space for it. A rot walker mask? Well, that sounds lovely. What? What the fuck is that? An anglerfish? That's weird. Oh god, there's so much resin here, and I just can't even. <sighs> One of the things I was looking for was resin, so... So I can add more power to my windmill.
Mm, no. Oh my gosh, Echo. <laughs> Very good. I guess. It's so bad, it's tolerable. No, I love it. And I still have to try and get myself home, too. I... oh god, I am so... wow. Wow! Look at all that! All that resin. Actually, I don't think it'll take too long. I've basically just traveled all the way up there so if i just carry around i actually i could just do a straight shot south from here that works out well actually that's really handy because i know i can just come up here in a few days and get more resin or have along the respawners all these pine trees. I'm not sure if the... Ooh. Make sure you do some stretches before you lay down then. Limber up a bit. I don't want to sound like a, uh, a bossy mom. But it might help. No. I don't want to sound like a bossy sister. Oh, look, how am I supposed to sail immediately south when there's land in the way? Okay, I'll be a bossy friend. Oh, I may still be able to sail through there. Did you did you see the picture I posted on Discord of our, our new stream friend? <laughs> Thanks, Ethor. Said Magellan, probably. I uh, I don't know. No one's, like, Prickly said my mic still sounds good. 
Um, so, I have no idea. The, the, actually, the, the difference it's made is I am acutely aware that there's <clears throat> some little googly eyes staring at me from like six inches away from my face. Look, there's more he can land. What the fuck? Come on, game. How oh dare. It's pretty cute, though. I think... <coughs> I hope. Um... Once I turn the fan up, it might help. I don't, I mean, the, the fan sound wasn't really an issue before, but if I can do something to, to sort of potentially prevent any further issues, then I'd rather do that, you know? I got the prettiest journal. I don't think it's going to work very well. Yeah, it's going to key out, but new journal for, for this year. Plus, I forgot that my other one ended in June. Yeah, it's kind of, you know, got the lupins. It's got a really pretty texture. Well, it's not texture, but it looks like it's been like brushed in oil, like done with oil paint. Yeah. That's what I'm, I'm using supposedly to like organize my stuff for stream. Apparently. Yeah. At least I forget that it exists. I have put my my Ohio trip in there though, so I keep thinking maybe I should keep track in there of what I stream each day. Because it's not always um, you know, like the VODs on stream don't stay forever unless you delete, um, especially upload them. Also, I got myself some really cute flip flops. I have to show you off stream. <clears throat> My old flip flops that I've had for like seven or eight years have are, are finally dying. My ten dollar ones from Walmart. It lasted well. Yeah. It made me sad because I love them so much. They had a really grippy sole on them. Like there was a, a real thick, um, like the, it was really deep grip on the soles. And they were basically just like entirely like rubber. Yeah, deep tread, thank you. <laughs> and the, the, and they were almost entirely rubber except for the strap over the foot so I could literally just chuck them in the shower or in the wash I didn't have to worry about 
falling apart or anything. I couldn't find any I liked at the store, so I, I was brave and ordered some from Amazon. And they seem to be okay. And they have flowers on them. Almost home. That was also bad. A little part of me wanted to make sure that I had like a, I don't know, the presentable stuff for when I am with friends. That's a good idea. I was looking at a pair of I don't know, they would they weren't Birkenstocks, but they were definitely like mom sandals and I was like actually you know what those looked pretty good think it's happening <laughs> oh no <laughs> oh no horrible got your toes I've I've attempted to mow a couple of times on flip flops and I always get told off Hey, how did I pick that back up? Fuck's sake. That. Eat. Oh, man, I did good there. Totally understandable. It's kind of late for you. I'm not surprised. in there. Progress is progress. Twenty liters of vinegar. Oh. 
I don't have 20 bottles. Wait, 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 wait. But what if... Wait. That's good for... Wait, 1.2 years? You know what? That's fine. I'm gonna leave it there. I did a bunch of cooking before, but a lot of, yeah, I said a lot of it was with spoiled turnips, so I probably just wasted a bunch of ingredients. Right, now let's see, back to our plant fiber box. So not quite enough. Oh god, all that work. Hole damaged. Please. Okay, so in or K crops. Oh, damaged my booty! You were fine until, like, I went out just then. Hey, give that pack. What did I say? A or oh heck. E and K? No, N or K. Averages? Ten. Whatever. Cabbages or carrots? I think cabbages. They look prettier. Yes. Cabbages and kinks. Right. How about we pick these up? You in there? Yeah. Better. I had to do a little bit of manual pruning on that oak tree just so I could get through the corner because I don't think it's growing anymore. I love that I can see the moon there. Uh, I got a good start on it. I know where I went wrong last time. Um, the other night when I was playing. But I'm fighting against the 
uh, the length of the axle as well. Um, but yeah, the problem is that it's basically, yeah. Um, it, the main axle is too long. So by the time it gets down here, there's just not much power. But what I was supposed to do is bring it down and then attach it to the inner, inner ring and then down from out. And my plan is basically to repeat that pattern a couple of times to increase the power down here. So it's moving and I know how to fix it. So if I put another large wheel and then go from the middle of this one to the outside of another large one, anything off the next wheel will have more power. So half the reason I was out looking for more resin was so I could make a bunch more wheels. So it's working, but it's just a bit slow. And I don't have enough power for, for this to work. Um, and because I don't have enough sails either, so. But yeah. Oh, I should have bought that extra. Do that actually before I forget. I might get some more berry crops. an extra where did I put it oh, up here here you come here I found a copper lamp on one of the uh, ruins today Oh, that scared me. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, what's that noise? Wait, it's me, I did that. <laughs> All right. I think I'm going to call it there. But we did make progress today. We got a bunch of flax planted, finally. We found some flax, so that's to upgrade the windmill up top. We found a bunch of resin to upgrade the windmill at the bottom. I thank you, Brickly. My, my cattails have, like, started growing, finally. And I just love these full colors. There's a lot more that I can do inside. I'm not happy with how it, it's laid out inside at all, but I love the outside of it. But we need more, need more vines. Thanks. I need a lot more vines and I need to tidy up all this mess. Yeah. And our cow grew up, our baby cow grew up, so now we have Three cows. Cows. Oh, oh. Salt. Yeah, exactly. Oh, now I want caramel. Mmm, caramel. Alright, I'm just gonna put you in there. Alright, let's see. 
I have no idea who's on right now. Oh no! Uh... Can I break the thanks for hanging out? Where's this person? Alright, I don't know who this person is, but we're gonna write them. Their name is Lady Snapdragon, they're playing Vintage Story. They have the tags LGBTQ friendly and their title is Catching Chickens, which sounds, you know, perfect. Um, so there's the raid messages. If you'd like to copy and paste those. Uh, perfect. And uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Not sure what with. And just as a reminder, Friday I will be late. Uh, very, very likely that I will be late. Ah! Here. Um, so I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. I don't know if we want to do more of this or if we want to play some Project Zomboid or some Assassin's Creed. We're just going to play it by ear. Good night, everyone. Thanks for hanging out. I've enjoyed your company. And I'm going to shut up now. Good night. Make good choices. Or make terrible ones and don't get caught. <laughs>